What do I think of Bob Lucas calling Hex a scam? I mean, dude, like, come on, get the fuck out of here. Like, calling Hex a scam and shit. Dude, if you call Hex a scam, then everything else in crypto is a fucking scam. I mean, like, literally, like, like the, the shit I hear about everyone talking about, like, like about, you know, even if, even if you look at Bitcoin, right? If nobody fucking was buying Bitcoin, if nobody was fucking buying Bitcoin, it would go to fucking zero. Everything goes to fucking zero if no one buys it. Like, are you, are you like, are they retarded? Like, it's just, look, everybody, what they're doing, what they're fucking doing, what they're motherfucking doing, what they're fucking doing is that they're talking shit about it right now. So if there's ever a fucking hiccup, you see, motherfuckers, huh, I told y'all, it's all for the revenge video. You see, you, you see, like, it failed. Ha, huh, I told y'all, guys. All these stupid fucks were too scared to say anything about Luna. That when Luna failed, they're like, holy shit, a couple of guys who said a little couple things about Luna, now are riding high up in the air and shit with their little tiny one-inch cock swinging in the air with their fucking, like, snibbled little fucking, like, razor brand, raisin brand, fucking testicles, charred chesticles, small little ball sack motherfuckers. And they're like, holy fuck, I missed my opportunity on Luna. Okay, okay, I'll call everything a scam. I'll call everything bullshit. And then when, when one of them fails, you see, this is why you guys should follow me. I told you guys this failed. I told you guys. Suck my dick. With this shit. God damn, dude. Like, uh, how, almost all the equity guys, almost, almost uh, other than a couple other motherfuckers, like, they're, they're, it's most, mo and any, any of the major equity guys that you see on YouTube are fucking just clowning and hurting and fucking shitting on crypto. When crypto was fucking up and shit, we were smacking that ass, huh? We're down 90% and we're still up more on our fucking crypto than all than the equities done in the last fucking five years. The only stock that's ever, ever performed some cryptos has just been Tesla and that shit's down too. God damn, dude. Like, what the fuck? And then the crypto guys, too. Like, you see, you guys? Like, let me tell you. Oh, my God. I want to say these fucking names. But, like, every major, any fuck, if you see most guys, other than maybe, like, like Data Dash, Data Dash has been pretty cool and stuff like that, and, like, a couple other guys as well. But, like, bro, like, pe people, people, like, like, when shit goes bear, they go bear. Like, they're, they're, like, these fuckers are just hurting people because of, look, all you gotta do is okay. Fuck, we're going down. We're going. The prices are going down right now. Okay, I'll save up half my cash. Look, I'll DCA on coins that I believe in. If the coin is starting, if I'm starting to see bad news, then I get out of the coin. Cool, I'll put the cash away. It's super, super shit. But what they're doing is just being super, just being fucking negative to everybody. Just being fucking negative, and this fucking negativity is fucking getting motherfuckers washed out. Like it's bad. And then what? And then I've seen this happen because I've seen this twice already. Two cycles I've seen this shit in is when the fucking prices are going down. You see, well, you should have been around in the bear market. How the fuck would I be around in the fucking bear market if you fucking were fucking were sh fucking shitting on it the whole fucking time? And I left. And then now, like, now you're shitting on me when the prices are going up. Well, stupid motherfucker, you should have bought when the prices were low. What? You fucking told me to leave. The fuck are you talking about? God damn, son. Like, people are fucking stupid. Fuck, man. Like, these motherfuckers are, like, they're so stupid. Like, what, the reason they haven't gone positive is because the positive content doesn't get as much views right now. The positive views doesn't get views right now. So they've gone full negative. Oh, fuck. Price are down. But, like, oh, my God. Like, everyone thought, like, my thoughts on Hex. People thought I'd be fucking, like, stomping Hex out. Like, oh, fuck. Fuck Hex. It's a scam. Fuck all this shit. Fuck no. Stay positive. Fuck, man. We got nothing else. If, 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 let's say, if everything goes to zero, we're fucked anyway. Fuck. At least we're better off fucking saying that. But these fuckers, they're so fucking negative. If, if shit did go to zero, these fuckers will rope themselves. They fucking rope themselves. Fuck. Fuck, man. Like, damn with these motherfuckers, man. Like... You have to stay fucking positive and stay in the game. You got to stay in the cut. You got a DCA and then you just got to take your opportunities and shit, right? If you got a fucking hundred, if, if you're fucking, if you're buying a coin, if you got a hundred bucks total to buy, right? You save 50 of those motherfucking dollars for when it, there's a giga crash. We're like, it's going to go to zero. That's when you fucking launch because it's your chance, right? 
And there's the other motherfuckers, right? Look, if you're super rich, there's different rules, right? If you got millions of dollars, if you got, if you got, if you got a person in the cup where you got 400, 500, 600 thousand dollars in the bank, you, you could fucking allocate 300 grand in one shot. You're playing by a little different rules. But the average guy, he's got to take his fucking shot. You got to take your fucking shot. Everybody who tells you like, oh no, you got to have a balanced portfolio. You have a ba- you have a crazy balanced portfolio where you have assets in a bunch of multiple places when you when you have money. But when you don't have money, you got to be fucking basically all in on something. And it doesn't mean just in one coin. I mean in a sector or like, like, like I'm all in equities or I'm all in crypto because that's the only way that you get, you fucking ascend. You ascend up the fucking Citadel that way, but you don't have it all in one coin. Breathe, motherfucker. Fuck. You have, like, that's what I did. That's what I did. And it fucking, it, it fucking worked. And it was hard and shit. I fucking, I worked my fucking ass off for fucking goddamn, like, I don't know how long just to, like, and then when I was finally making good money, instead of fucking partying or putting any of that money away or, like, doing anything, I fucking put it into what I believed in and what I believed in worked. I bought big. I finally got, I got my first fucking Bitcoin. I got a bunch of Ethereum, and then I bought Hex. I bought fucking Cardano. I fucking bought Doge and shit at the right fucking times. Took profits on that shit, and then kept it fucking moving, kept growing. And then I was like, wow. And then I looked back to me, where, where the fuck is everyone else? Nowhere to be found. And I was like, what the fuck? What the fuck, man? So I was like, where the fuck's my tribe? And then you know what I did? I was like, I went on. I I went to the fucking red pill, and I was like, oh shit. I need. I found some other motherfuckers just like me. They're, they're talking about other shit, but the passion's there. We're helping people. And I was like, fuck it. If no one's going to help anybody in here, I will. And then I found, and I found me and Charlie together and shit. We fucking have taught more motherfuckers in this space than anybody in this fucking game. God damn, dude. And we put our fucking balls and fucking necks on the line talking this shit and stuff, getting people in and stuff. But let me tell you this. The amount of people who we, we got into the crypto space... Would have never gone into the crypto space. They would have been in here fucking years late buying the prices fucking five times higher by the time they fucking got in. And then half of them would have got to fucking roll the fuck out. Roll the fuck out. Whew. Man, I got the Holy Ghost going through me right now, man. Shit. There's a fucking wall. Punch that shit. There you go. Man. Did it at the cost of the